Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Mrs. Smith88. I know you guys have either seen the Ipsy video already or you will be seeing the Boxy Charm video first. I've already explained in the Ipsy one, yes, I look like a mess. Sloppy bun, half caked makeup that has worn off. But I did want to go ahead and film this video for you guys. This is my Boxy Charm premium unboxing for you guys. So this month the theme is boxy charm spellbound i absolutely love the card with the purple and the faciated lights in it so the variation i got is c21102030-1 pm and my total box had a retail value of 185 dollars so with this being a premium, I did get to pick two of my items. Here is my Boxy Charm box. So I did get to pick two of my items. Let's go ahead and see what I picked. So I know I picked this, and this is the Lily Lashes Level Up Lash Enhancing Serum. Now, personally, not a product that I will use, but the choices were quite lackluster this month, so this will be a declutter. It does have a retail value of $65. It says that it is a new launch. It says, Level Up Lash Enhancing Serum is a powerful result-driven lash serum promoting ultimate lengthening, strengthening, and conditioning benefits while enhancing the overall overall appearance of your natural lashes in as little as four weeks. So I know a lot of people tend to be into lash serums and that kind of stuff. I just rock my little shorties, throw a little bit of mascara on them, or if I'm feeling extra one some days, I will throw on the magnetic eyelashes. So the next choice item I grabbed, this is the Rowan, and this is the Vow Brow. So I currently have two brow pencils in my collection. Both were from BoxyCharm. One was the Wonder Beauty, absolutely love it. The other was the Fenty Beauty, and I actually have that one on today. My brows do not look the greatest right now. Like I said, makeup has worn off. I've had it on since like seven o'clock this morning and it is nearly 7 p.m. now. The color they sent me is medium, so I do think that color is gonna be spot on. So the retail value of the Rowan Beauty Vow Brow Pencil is $26. It says Vow Brow is the perfect brow pencil to easily define, fill, and shape any brow. Val Brow's fine 1.7 millimeter tip and firm formula is ideal for both precise and natural looking brows. Use the built-in spoolie brush to blend and comb so it sounds like it's very similar to the Wonder Beauty one. Val Brow comes in three shades and has been tested on different brows, shapes, and skin tones. Rowan Beauty is made with with clean ingredients that don't compromise the performance. So pretty excited for this. Would I spend $26 on a Rowan eyebrow pencil? Probably not because I'm not super familiar with the brand. I don't even think I would spend $26 on a Fenty brow product. I mean, yeah, I like the Fenty, but I like getting this stuff in my box because I'm cheap and I'm A-OK -okay with being cheap. So those were the two choice items. I have four items left and these are the items that were picked for me. So first off, I'm really excited for this because I love good skincare and Paracone MD is quite a prestige brand to be receiving in my box. So this is the Paracone MD and this is the Vitamin C Ester Citrus Brightening Cleanser. This has a retail value of, let's see, where's it at on here? One, two, three, oh, there we go, $35. So $35 for this cleanser. It says Paracone MD's Vitamin C Ester Citrus Brightening Cleanser is a non-drying formula that cleanses without stripping the skin of natural oils. This fresh cleanser is formulated with Paracone MD's proprietary proprietary, if I could speak, you guys should know, I cannot speak in these videos, proprietary vitamin C ester, 
a more potent and less irritating form of vitamin C to visibly smooth and brighten. It also contains DMAE to visibly lift and copper complex to hydrate and energize skin. So definitely this is a win. This item alone paid for the premium box. It's like everything else was a complete bonus. So, so far, I definitely think that this is going to be a good box. So, we also received the Dew of the Gods Under Eye Volumizing Collagen Pads. This is a 10 count. It is in like a tin container here. Honestly, it's a brand I'm not familiar with. And oftentimes, I don't feel comfortable putting brands I'm not familiar with on my face. Because I obviously... I don't want to induce breakouts. I rarely get breakouts and I want to keep it that way. So the Do With The Gods retails for $20. It says a Y inject when you can object to dull, tired, under eyes with the powerful bounce of hydrogel, collagen, vitamin C, and witch hazel to plump, lift, and revitalize your look. It's like an iced coffee for the soul. 30 minutes of bliss. Each philopod is blessed by a Zen Buddhist monk. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I think that's a line of crap. Uh, to inspire the power of gratitude, what are you thankful for? So I guess I am thankful for BoxyCharm filling us with a line of crap because I highly doubt that this product is blessed by a Buddhist monk. So like I said, this is going to be a pass. I don't want my skin breaking out. Two items are from brands that I am familiar with. I did receive the Tarte Man Eater Lip Gloss. This one is in the shade Buff. i seen that some people were getting the mauve shade. Really would have liked to have gotten the mauve shade. Not sure if I'm going to keep this. I may pass this on to my daughter. So this has a retail value of $19. So it says apply Tarte's Man Eater Plumping Gloss for visibly plumper looking lips. The nourishing formula smooths the lips and wraps them in lasting hydration, color, and shine while the volume plump complex works to visibly plump the lips in just one swipe. So really nice that we are receiving a lip gloss product from Tarte in here. Really good cosmetic company. I'm very happy with the variety of makeup and skincare items in this box. The last item is the item I am most excited for. This was not a choice item. This was an item that was just randomly put in my BoxyCharm box. And that is Benefit. And this is a new shade. It's called Georgia. And I know there were some complaints with others on this product because it is so light in color that it's honestly only going to work on fair skin tones. Those with darker skin tones may be able to utilize it as a highlight. As you guys can see, I am pretty fair, so I think this is going to work out really well for me. So super excited about that. This has a retail value of $30 for this blush, and I do have other benefit blushes, like my favorite one is Rockator. I absolutely love that blush. So it says, a peachy dream come true. Benefit's cult favorite, Georgia Golden Peach Blush, is back and sweeter than ever. Georgia is a warm, vibrant peach shade with a soft golden shimmer for a hint of glow. This silky smooth, super fine powder blends effortlessly to give cheeks a fresh picked flush and oh, and a peachy keen sheen. So let's go ahead and open this up to see what it looks like. Like most Benefit blushes, you do get the little brush. And this brush did work really good with the um, Rockator for me. But I do know that some people are saying with this being a lighter shade, they're not having much luck with that brush picking up the actual product. So if not, I mean, obviously there are other blush brushes. Mine honestly kind of looks dirty. It's kind of gross looking. Like, I feel like, am I seeing things? Okay, so it is a peachy color, but mine looks like it has dirt on it. And I highly doubt that the camera is going to pick that up. But there are, like, almost like a dusty dirtiness. 
that one's sitting on it. I don't know what to think about that. I'm hoping it's just the shadow of my lighting. Because I really want to love this. Because like I said, I was so excited for it. So that is everything that I got in my boxy charm this month. It did have a retail value of $185 for this premium box. Definitely let me know what you guys think down below. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you for watching and bye everyone.